Hello, hello, Virgo, and welcome into Speak Life. My name is Mia. Today, we are going to see into your weekly reading and see what comes up for you, Virgo. Please, universal energies, spirit guides, ancestors. All right. You have two here, so I'm going to keep these. And we're going to have one more. Please, universal energy, spirit guides, ancestors, please bring in one more for Virgo, sun, moon, rising, and Venus. Please, universal energy, spirit guides, ancestors, please bring in one more message for Virgo, sun, moon, rising, and Venus. Come on, you guys are sleeping on me. <laughs> there we go. All right, so I got two, I'll take them. Okay, you have your breathe. Listen, take a deep breath, okay, and move forward. Take a deep breath, breathe in the fresh air. Um, you also have your observer, okay, looking at something extremely close here and now. Think about the present moments, okay? You are not in the past. You are not in the present. Think of right now, here, right now, be in the present, okay? You also have here a change in the winds, okay? Some of you were heading in a, in a, in a direction and somewhere along the line, your little mind says, it's time to change the direction okay so now some of you are going either against the winds or in a totally new different direction okay a change in the wind i like that it always says that you know the universe is trying to guide you where you should be please universal energy spirit guides ancestors please bring forward three messages for virgo sun moon rising and venus please universal energies Spirit guides, ancestors, please bring forward three cards. There we go. Okay. Please universal energies, spirit guides, ancestors, please bring forward one more message for Virgo, sun, moon, rising, and Venus. Please, universal energies, spirit guides, ancestors, please bring forward one more. One more. There we go. All right, I got two. I'll take them. Okay, so we have here um, <clears throat> Virgo. Uh, moving away, moving to calmer water, going across the water. This could be a trip that some of you are wanting to take. No intention on coming back. Um, you also have here the Knight of Swords in the past. There was somebody that could have delivered a message to you, you to them. Okay, this is a message. It's an angry message. It's a childish act. You know, it's somebody that just just wants to talk out of their ass is what I'm hearing. Um, you have here... Um, Queen of Swords, for some of you, there's a decision that has already been made, okay? This was maybe a decision that either you made, somebody else made, take it as it fits. Um, then you have here the Queen of Chalices, okay? For some of you, this is same-sex energy reading um, with the Queen of Chalices. There are two queens in this reading, um, somebody who's very intuitive. Listen, it still could be you, okay? You could literally be like making a decision and Looking at things, you know, like following your own intuition. This could also be a male too. Remember, this channel has no gender. I only read the energy that comes through. Um, so let's see. What do we have here? Magician. So some of you manifested this move, okay? Some of you worked very hard on... Some of you worked very hard on making this happen for you. You know, this change, this trip. I'm hearing something about a trip. Um, Knight of Swords. There was something that, that changed you on this trip. There was something that you used to change your outcome of this trip. Okay? Um, Knight of Swords. Why is it here for Virgo? Knight of Swords. Knight of Swords. 
Ace of Wands. <clears throat> Ace of Wands, starting a brand new beginning. Some of you decided, you know what? I'm not investing in this bullshit anymore. I'm going to um, basically start a brand new something. You're going to work some magic, okay? Some of you are working some magic, you know, into your situation. You also have here the Knight of Cups. Somebody wants to come in and they want to offer you something. I really don't think you are going to accept it, okay? Why is the Queen of Swords here? Queen of Swords. This person, oh, let me tell you something. This person made you, they went, they, they made you go through some shit, okay? Five of cups. Some of you um, could still be crying over spilled milk over the fact that this person made a decision. Um, it looks like there was broken promises as part of this, broken promises, broken dreams, um, you know, a lot of tears, grieving, and then you have here the high priestess. So some of you are ev um, elevating up, I feel. Um, I feel that there was a lot of energy um, feelings that you took away with you and just kind of kept quiet about it. You know, let's see. Why is the queen of cups here? Please universal energies, queen of cups. Okay, third party energy, okay? Somebody here was juggling, okay? Somebody here was juggling. This is why some of you were hurt in the situation with the five of swords. This is all the fuckery in the world, okay? All the fuckery in the world. Some of you, I'm gonna tell you, if you don't get yourself out of this energy, you are going to continue to suffer. You are going to continue to be put in third party equations and you're gonna have to continue to kind of fight for this, you know? I hope that this made sense for some of you. Thank you so much for being here and take care.